Looks like there's a fake horse on the road. It's all shiny. It would have moved by now. Very lifelike. I can hear some kind of a beeping. This is like some kind of a farming village. And this is the same deer, I think. Got all kinds of fence shoots and, and, and structures. Let's see if the deer is right around. There he is. <laughs> All kinds of... Whoa, he jumped right over that fence. Oh, this is where they string up the animals. And then gut them. Wow. That's certainly an animal gutter. And then, wow, this... There's more farm over there. This is neat. Yeah, there's a lot of flies because there's a lot of poop. Those are the carts that you stow away in. This thing goes for a quite a distance. People may do like horse rides. It's all, it's all for display. Spreading out the animals and they're different sectors. I'm guessing that the train tracks are not being used because of those, those boxes, those box cars. Oh yeah, we got a lot of this display. Actually, this doesn't look like it's for display at all. This is just, these are just extras for the maintenance. Extras that they just don't know where to put up, I guess. Placer diggings. Yeah, an old, old uh, wagon. Several. One for the tracks. They just don't have anywhere to put them up, I guess. It's pretty neat. There's various stuff. It's got rubber on it, so it's more modern. So yeah, they, they store all the unused stuff way back here. It's not exactly part of the tour. Alright, I guess I'll head back and Maybe check out the other side. Guess I can go down that way. There's some, that gets you, that road goes by the horses, but they probably will run away. There's about six horses. All right, so this might lead to the road. Some kind of a, a woodpecker, two woodpeckers. <clears throat> oh, but I'm locked in. Oh my God, there's cars. There might be people here. <sighs> might be people living on the property. Well, I'm just getting a peek. <clears throat> All right, so the administrative office right over there. This crosses me back over. In a roundabout way. Yeah.
Alright, so this, they took out quite a bit of the prison. Let's see if I can see anything of good interest. Not really, no. That wall, man. That red building is a center. That's just the center. There's somebody, there's somebody walking in the prison. There's a prisoner. How did he get in? Huh. It's all locked up. Must be the caretaker. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna just... I'm just gonna get this. Alright. Now why is this thing... Is that for squirrels or something? There's a guy walking around back here, and I think he probably drove this. Probably some kind of a caretaker. This is pretty neat. Okay, and then the prison kind of veers off. It's a big drop below, so the prisoners who escape behind have to go through, I don't know what. What's this? Why did they build this? Maybe for the fence? Oh my God, mosquitoes are really bad. The last spike. And you can see the, the sun set off in the distance. You can see stairs that go high to the higher elevation when the, when the guards walk that wall. <laughs> it's kind of a narrow wall. Huh. These guys all dressed up. What's he all dressed up for? That's weird. One house claims to use private well water. Private well water in use? Seems unlikely in the city. So they're claiming that this church was built in 1884. Kind of weird to see one side higher than the other. Did something happen? They double back around on this street, but there's nobody to watch them. Well, okay, they break up sort of.
Right, it's been a long time since I've gotten caught in the rain, but it's definitely raining out there. So there's no exploring. I think it's only supposed to last an hour. Maybe these choke cherries don't turn black. Maybe there's two types. Maybe there is a red, a red and a black. Maybe that tree is sick because it's growing right next to a very tarred bridge. These are black. Blacker is blacker is more desirable. So this is an ac supposed to be an accurate depiction of a size of a regular teepee. I kind of walked in them before. You don't have a lot of room. Oh, it's for sale. Valley Foods. All right, so this is the old prison. Big, big old wall. Wow, this must have been a state prison or something. And they figured this is out in the middle of nowhere enough. Wow. People have actually climbed up there and wrote the graffiti. Oh man. No trespassing, no breaking the prisoners out. What a wall. It's like a castle. And they give tours inside that are, it's a train off in the distance there. That's probably not cheap. Imagine scaling this thing. You definitely get hurt jumping over. And then there's a business called Prison Pizza. This thing is like a couple of, a few football fields. Whew. Incredible size. The center, is this just the, yep, this is just the center. Oh, all right, and then the door is, is shut, locked. This is all it is, they lock it on the inside. Let me in, let me in! And then they got an auto, auto museum at the end. The prison cow? Hmm. 
<clears throat> oh, here. Okay, and then they're going to give prices. The old Montana prison. Yeah, what's the price? Check in at visitor admission. Fee is required. Yeah, screw that. There's probably plenty of plenty of video. All right, I'm on camera. Collection donations. Okay, so they locked it, and you can see you win this car. And this is a part of the prison. Huh? They leave this unlocked. Maybe because people turn in the, the paperwork or something. That's pretty neat though. Scale the wall to get in and <laughs> break in.